Is Max Verstappen pulling out of Red Bull to join Mercedes? There's been a lot of crazy news today on this Monday, which is still a race week. So let's hop right into it. Happy Monday, everyone. I hope you had just a fan freaking tastic first race weekend in Bahrain. It was, you know, it was kind of what we expected, honestly, at the end of the day, but that's okay. It's the first race. Things can change. Things can get better. Please, please get better. But we're not gonna, we're not here to talk about Bahrain because it is Monday morning and Josh woke up to crazy news in the world of F1. So to start with, the investigation in Christian Horner was done, but then it's kind of popped back into the limelight because of a lot of different things online. Not really gonna get into it right now because I think there's a lot that we still don't even know really what happened. But I, what I will say, it is interesting that it's, it's still happening and there's still info coming out and there's still things going on. I know people are gonna say, oh, but Josh, the internal investigation has been completed. That is true. The only thing I'm gonna say to that is, an investigation being completed does not say whether someone did or did not do something at the end of the day. So that is all I'm going to say on that. But what is interesting is because of this continuing investigation, we have a few pieces of news. One, Ford is apparently looking to pull out of the deal with Red Bull to join, you know, and become part of the engine supplier team. And they are like, talking to lawyers they are figuring out how to come get out of this contract which is crazy because this was a crazy announcement made about a year ago and and ford is just going to potentially pull out of this deal now to follow that up max verstappen is apparently in talks with mercedes and other teams to potentially leave red bull i don't know if he will no one really knows what's going to happen i know there's a lot of speculation because Jos Verstappen is saying a lot of things in the paddock, um, and I'm going to be honest, of all the people to talk about how you should be as a person, I, I don't think that man is really uh, quite the credible source as the man that left Max Verstappen at a gas station and probably wasn't the best father at the end of the day, but hey, who am I to judge? I'm just, I'm just here to say what I've heard at the end of the day. So yes, Max Max may be leaving Red Bull, and according to Helmut Marco, he has he has the green light. According to sources, he can leave. There is no stipulation in his contract that says he has to stay. There's nothing. Um, he could leave. Is he going to leave in like the middle of the season? No, obviously not. Like that's not going to happen. Um, but he does have the ability to leave. Adrian Newey potentially is in talks to leave Red Bull Racing. Um, a lot of people rumored to be in talks of leaving Red Bull, which brings me to something interesting. We are still up in the air on, on what is going on with this whole thing with Christian Horner. I'm obviously not gonna show any of these photos or text messages. I'm sure a lot of you have seen them. There's rumors that they are fake, that they are you know AI generated, that they are not real. At the end of the day, if they are real, if these are real text messages, um, there's there's a lot that can be kind of discerned from what's going on and, and kind of figured out. Um, but if they are real, at, at the very bottom level, Christian cheated on his wife, just, and that is it. Like, that is 100% guaranteed if all of this is true. What is beyond that is, you know, for other people to figure out. But if you're gonna let, if you're gonna let Christian stay, if, if all of this is true, and it's going to potentially take out a giant partner of Ford, it's going to have Max leave, it's going to have Adrian leave, it's going to have all this domino effect. It is insane to me that you would, even for a second, consider then letting Christian stay. Um, it, it, there, there has to be something going on that either Red Bull knows that we don't know, or, or just something going on because at the end of the day, if it was just, you know, Red Bull saying, oh, we're going to keep him, everyone's on board. You could kind of make some inferences. You could still be up in the air on, you know, what's actually happening. But now that there's so many people saying they might be leaving Red Bull, they're, you know, in talks with other people, it does leave a lot of questions about what is actually happening at Red Bull Racing. And I don't really want to comment a lot about it because at the end of the day, that's what it is. It's speculation. There's some sources. There's some rumors. But there's not a lot for sure. Uh, will Max leave Red Bull? Who knows? It would be it would be insane. I will say it would be crazy to see Max leave Red Bull because one, it would be it would be kind of fun. It would be kind of fun to see him in a different car next year. That would be that'd be kind of fun. And I mean, guys, just just hear me out. 
Charles Leclerc. He's done. He's done. He's had it. He's over Ferrari. He leaves. And we see what we've always wanted to see. Max and Lewis together in Ferrari. Lock it in. That's Josh's prediction. It's not going to happen. But you never know. You never know. The third... Don't know what that voice crack was, but the third interesting piece of information today is that Ben Salayam is under investigation for apparently attempting to bribe stewards to remove a penalty from a driver last year. The rumor is that it's for it was for Fernando Alonso for a penalty that he received that potentially took him off the podium or something like that, which is crazy. Again, it's still under invest investigation. Who knows if this is true or not? If it's true, though, oh good God, that is. That is such a bad look, and that man will for sure be out of a job, no doubt, if it's true. 100% will be out of a job. But, like, the the fact that this is just on a Monday morning, this is a Monday morning, and all of this is happening is crazy. This is the start of a race week. Who knows? Who knows what's going to happen the rest of this week, honestly? the the Things could be crazy. Stay tuned. Definitely, if you're not one to normally watch the, the press conference on... Thursday, but I, I think I was on Wednesday this week. Oh my God, watch it because there's gonna. I have a feeling there's gonna be some. There's gonna be some spicy questions for sure. But yeah, that's kind of it. That's the crazy news drama <laughs> wrap up for this Monday morning. Who knows? Let me know in the comments. Do you think Max would actually go to Red Bull or to Red Bull? Do you think he would actually go to Mercedes? Do you think he'll leave Red Bull? Give me your give me your thoughts, your opinions on all that because there is just a lot that happened today, a lot to process. But Thank you all for watching. Have a happy, fantastic race week, Jetta. Go McLaren, and see you all in the next video. Bye.